Tell me what up, gang. Oh, 4.40 in the morning, bro. Bright and early. <laughs> Before the sunrise, fool. You know how I get down. But, nah, we going to the lake. We got to go run. So, I'm going to tap it when I get there. Oof. I got a good sleep last night, though. I fell asleep so early. So, I'm going to tap it with you. You dig? Dropping the toss off. Going to hop in with Mally P. At King's Hop. We got to go. Yes, sir. Team run, team run, everyone's happy. Woo, everyone's happy, yay, team run, woo. Man, that was a splendid day. Splendid day. <laughs> Bro, I'm just blessed. So beautiful. The first mile's been straight uphill the whole time. But with views like this, it doesn't even matter. Yes, sir, gang. About halfway done. Easy work, light work. I love my life. I love where I'm at. I love what I'm doing. Yeah, sir. Little lookout point four and like a half miles in blessed grateful so beautiful man god i feel great i feel amazing let's get back to it another peak good job so beautiful so beautiful i just want to jump how much <laughs> we made it gang we did it yes sir how can you not be grateful how can you not how can you just not admire this, bro? Everything I've ever done in my life has led me up to this point, and I am blessed and grateful that it has. I hope y'all are enjoying your Monday. Top three most beautiful runs I've done. I'm so grateful, dude. Man, a lot of things in this life are gonna throw you for a loop, you feel me? And this life, it's not gonna give you what you want unless they test you, fool. It's so the funny thing about life is, <clears throat> it's only gonna give you what you deserve. Now, if you're constantly working towards something, it's gonna give you, but it's gonna give you trials and tribulations throughout and to make sure that you deserve it. Because at the end of the day, greatness is for the chosen few that chase greatness. I tell this every time, but if greatness was easy to achieve or happiness or comfortability was easy to achieve everyone would do it. everyone would achieve it everyone would be done everyone would be happy live and go lucky but it's not that's not how life works you feel me and uh you got to be grateful for the journey once you learn to enjoy the journey no matter what result it is you'll be happy with so let me tap in with you after what up gang i forgot to tap in immediately after but here's pace i was sliding um great run you guys seen it throughout it was mad hills up and down side to side beautiful fucking views man great time i love like i love a good run that you can for me just vibe to and just lose your mind and and enjoy nature and enjoy everything and enjoy everything that comes with it bro the life that we live is so blessed the fact that I'm able to wake up, breathe, talk to y'all, film this, and and do what I'm doing, I'm just beyond blessed, and I appreciate everything, and I appreciate the fact that y'all watching. So, I'm gonna tap in with y'all when I get home, shower, and everything. Made me a little bit of tang, which y'all know spilt about half the container though. <laughs> no bully, I'm finna take a nap. I'm gonna tap in with y'all after. What a game! It's like an hour later. I'm gonna go get me some nectar. I'm gonna tap in. Feel me? Back to Garrett. Yes, sir. Oh, I don't have much to do. <laughs> if anything, to be honest. Um, So, I'm gonna just tap in with y'all when I decide I wanna try to not make this vlog as boring as I am. <laughs> but yes, sir, we spawn tomorrow. Ooh. Sparta tomorrow, but I'll tap in with you. For the next two hours, I'll be watching Goodwill Hunting and seeing if I can cry. Yes, sir. I indeed finished Goodwill Hunting. Very sad. Oh, yeah. God. God, God, God. I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> I don't care at all. <laughs> I forgot to show y'all, but I have one of these. Yes, sir. You did. Same old, same old. <sighs> Today was a 
not that productive, but we're here close to the fight, so we like tapering down. Plus, I'm sparring tomorrow, so I'm not too worried. Good run this morning, bro. Great vibes. Um, I feel good. Just feel a little bored, but it's all good. Ain't no worries. That's a good problem to have, I guess, is to just be bored because you already handled your responsibilities type. Um, yeah, gang, gonna finish this little same old, same old walk ski and tap in with you when I get home and read and journal. Yes, sir. What up, gangsters? You already know the drill. It's time to actually finish this. I've been procrastinating on finishing it because honestly, I love the book and I don't want to finish it. And then we got the journal, of course. But um, y'all, today I saw a really good post. I reposted it on my Instagram. If y'all, if y'all from the Instagram, of course, you've already seen it. But um, it says, don't take your old feelings into new experiences. And that shit just resonates with me real big time. You feel me? And that's just with anything. Um, you have to, like what I was talking yesterday. You have to change to grow, right? And how you gonna change if you have these past experiences, these these past feelings holding you back? Because you can enter a new experience with the same feelings, and you're gonna get the same outcome because you have the same feelings. You feel me? So it's not really a new experience. It becomes your same old experience, and that's what we get caught in this this monotonous rut of cycling negative thoughts, cycling negative feelings, and uh, there's no reason to. You feel me? Honestly, like. It's crazy because it's as simple as it. It's as simple as this, but it's maybe simple, but it's complicated to put into effect. But if you just don't think about them, whatever you don't think about won't upset you. So if you think about your problems, then you're going to be upset about your problems. But if you just don't think about the problems and just focus on the positive and focus on what's good, everything's going to work out and you're going to be in a feel me, more positive mindset. And what comes with a more positive mindset is a positive outcome. So simple um, to me seems like, I mean, some people might say that's a uh, immature or unrealistic to say that you're not going to think about like negative thoughts or I guess problems. Right. Because I mean, often, I mean, as we grow, as we get older and life hits us in our face, you feel me? We actually have real world problems. And I'm not saying like, don't feel me address your issues and, and if they're real world, if they're there, your, your rent's due tomorrow and you ain't got no bread. I'm not saying don't do nothing about it, but I'm saying if it's something that you truly can't control, it's out of your it's out of your hands. And you feel me? It's not really going to benefit you to harp on it, except it's only going to make it bigger. Then don't harp on it. You feel me? As simple as that. But let's go. 13 days out. I'm ready. I feel good. Today's run was great. Um. Wish I'm been a little more productive, but I wish that every day. <laughs> stay positive, stay great. I love y'all. See y'all tomorrow.